Uh, Meta Knight? I don't know if he plays Meta Knight anymore. DK? Okay. All right, yo, you got this, dude. La Luna coming up next on this stream against yep. Rags, but for now we La have Loons. Kasev, Snake versus yes. Blue Pony. All right, man, going in game one on Smashville. So, of course, this is a very, very classic matchup. I think that it's interesting to note that uh, even though this matchup, these characters are somewhat different, I think it plays very, very similar in terms of the points of contention. Uh, one being, of course, offstage game. You want to have Snake off there or go for the juggles. Uh, one great thing, of course, for Wario as a whole is that clap, man. You're going to see that standing ovation happen time and time again. And that is going to be either that juggles, Woo! get off the side of the stage, what? and then punish from there with Bear. What was that? And whatnot. Yeah, that what was What was that? Yo, that was so scary. He didn't get it to work. Yeah. But he had the bike come down yeah. as a hitbox and his down air. Yeah, that's actually sick. I've never. Okay, my goodness. What's with this? Back air, yes. Yards. And that's such a cool thing, man. For Wario, he can actually trace someone like that, and he can utilize his amazing aerial acceleration to still punish them back on that landing, man. All right. They try to cross up. All right, good stuff. I, I appreciate that he's actually going for the Nikita. I think that is a good choice. However, eating that grenade, that's not going to be too good for Wario. Yeah. Uh-oh, up tilt. He got the oh, ring. All right, that's no, a mistake that people make. They like to get let the up tilt hit or block, hit the shield, and they try to grab, but they can't grab after the first yeah. up tilt. But you know what's funny, too? Because it hit the shield, that's why he actually survived. Because, again, guys, remember, decay does happen on shield in this game. That is very, very Ooh. important to know. Oh, my gosh, the parry. That was risky right there, deciding to go for that. No. Uh, the pedestrian life, man. Get out of here. Yo, I'm loud in my mic. <laughs> Are you? Huh? Are you loud? Oh, yeah. I'm, yeah, 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 I'm yeah. definitely loud. <laughs> All right, I'm here we go. <laughs> At home, <laughs> put the speakers down. <laughs> All right, and Kesev doing a fantastic job, making sure to keep Lutini out of range. However, this is the troublesome part whenever Snake is in the air or off the stage. How is he going to be able to land? And it seems like he's able to land every single time. Yeah, yeah, Lutini needs to take advantage of that. Absolutely. I, I do like that you see Lutini actually uh, shifting his combo game to get him off the stage. You notice how he didn't go for the standard uh, bear or up airs uh, afterwards, uh, after mm -hmm. he had gotten an initial uh, nair. He went for a back air to hit him off side of stage. So... I love to see that. Oh my god, there it is. <laughs> there it is. You can confirm up tilt into WAP. And I probably and it might actually be the best confirm you can do yeah, in general yeah. in yeah. like uh, this game. Yep. Yeah, it's nuts. In there, yep. And that's where you go from thinking, oh man, I can do this, I can do this into damn, I am on down an entire stop yeah. right now. <laughs> How did I get there? And he might get WAP again. Exactly. That's the scary part about it, because it's three stop. Yeah. That's another thing about this game. That makes Wario better too. Besides Wario just being a way better character in this game, I think stocks. top tier. Yeah. It's the three stocks that allow him to get wafted again. Yeah. Alright, let's see if you recover. Not that up to percent, so we're going to see some struggle coming out. Sit back. And okay. Oh my goodness. Alright, no waft just yet, so only up till into up air. Yeah. Which is still a good combo confirmed. Absolutely. And again, man. He's been very, very on point on those land, uh, punishing those landing aerials with a parry. Straight out of uh, grenade, too. Yeah, right now, Gluttony is not finding the best time to be able to run in, and that's why he keeps letting that happen. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, my wow. goodness. Wow. Two farts. There you go. All right. That was just enough. All right, well, good stuff to Gluttony being able to take that first game. It looked really scary in the beginning. I think Kasev got the first stock, but then Gluttony took the next three, so kind of didn't really matter. Yo, happy feet, man. Wombo Combo. Wombo Combo, man. Happy feet. Let's see what KSF can do different this time. This, this matchup, I do think, is pretty hard for Snake because he just gets juggled like crazy. Yeah. Thrown in the air. That's all Wario likes to do. He likes to have you in the air off the stage. He has crazy horizontal aerial momentum. Even uh, vertical is pretty good. Yeah. So you, you're just like, whoa, how do I keep him out? Like, when's he coming in? And that's why you're seeing KSF play a gameplay where he's just trying to keep Wario away from him. But it's hard. Yeah. It's really hard. Like, very, Snake very doesn't hard. have fa fast aerials. His arrows, like, they come out quick. Some of them, like, is down air. Yeah. And I forgot what times, frame it is, but yeah. A lot of times what you need to do is just, like, kind of really... Uh, I believe down air is frame four. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Yeah, so it's a... New, yeah, new basically problem. a frame seven move. Scary. All right, well, here we go. Game number two. Kesev playing that. This is the thing about Snake. Some people are like, I don't know how, if I like Snake. Because, you know, he keeps camping. And it, and it is a thing about playing Snake where you're pressing all these buttons, but look how much damage he did. Yeah. He pressed like 5,636.3 buttons. And, <laughs> <I guess. laughs> and Wario's probably going to come in with like a neutral air and still do damage to him first. Yep. Watch, watch, watch this, watch this, watch this. <laughs> I told you, man. <laughs> Wario coming with that neutral air. All that, dude. 
It's and patience. he has a rough part. It really takes patience. Oh my goodness. Wow, three. Four. Hey, yo. That is definitely a land. round of applause, man. He can't land, dude. Oh my goodness. That's the thing, too. If you try to take out Grenade while landing on Wario, especially against Glutton, he sees that and he's just like, I'm just going to grab you, throw you, and the grenade will still be there. Exactly. Waiting to explode. I do not care. 98%. And that's the thing about Glutiny. Sometimes he just likes to hang back. Like, Sweet will be 100% aggressive. Glutiny will sometimes be like, all right, I'll just wait a bit. See what's going on. Let the yeah. waft charge up. Yep. So no need to approach. Yeah. yeah. Time is of the essence, man. It really is up against Kevin. Oh my gosh, the dash back forward smash. That is the classic right now. Gonna take that stock. And Glutiny is staying at 37%. Good Glutiny. choice of actually going for that F smash. He did that on the bike, too, so the hitbox can stay out longer. Yeah. Okay. Uh, going ahead and read that uh, that corner roll. Gets him with a dash track to hit him off stage. All right, scary thing about this again. He did not use his waft yet, so we might see it coming out pretty soon, especially if you can get that up tilt combo, 47%. That will KO. Oh, absolutely. Uh -oh, don't oh, roll in. For dashing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he was looking for that right yeah, there. Yeah, roll in. Uh, that would have been your stock. He's Look definitely looking for this waft really hard. Don't roll in. <laughs> Good choice. <laughs> again, and that's it. Oh, it doesn't matter. Boom. This character has a rest and is not as yes. light as Jigglypuff. He is heavy jigs, man. I say it all the time. He is heavy jigs. That is why this character is so powerful. First time Leffen and Glutiny played, it was like a friendly. And Glutiny immediately three stock Leffen. And people are like, Bee! no. This is what Wario does. He takes off your first stock. He gets the waft the second stock. And then now you're defeated. Yep. <laughs> like, what are you going to do? <laughs> yeah. And the thing is, remember, k is playing Snake. So he can't really go aggressive. Yeah. He has to hang back. Oh, and here comes the combos. He's one of those characters where you really have to play him almost kind of Street Fighter-esque uh, in terms of, like, meter management. Like, A, you need to understand when he's going to get WAP, and B, you need to recognize... Oh, my, oh my gosh. gosh. The parry, oh, uh, my goodness. And again, the three-stock might just happen right now, especially yeah. with the WAP coming back live. Oh, my gosh. Sick. Is still. he going to land? Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Okay, he's going to suck. Uh, I believe down, he has to be careful. Down tilt, uh, dash attack. Yeah, can work. Can yes. confirm. Yes. Auto. That's auto combo. Yep. Pretty shocking to see. And snakes in air. Be reverse. Beautiful. That can Easy. actually KO too. Yep. The command grab, <laughs> which is which is wild, by the way. It can yeah. KO, especially if you get them near the ledge yeah. for ledge trapping. So you think, let me just shield oh. and I'm fine. Yeah. Nope. Yeah, can try to go for a down tilt dash attack. You messed it up there. Drop it. Gives uh, it time. Oh, oh my gosh. What happened to that waft, actually? It looked like it was supposed to come out. He had to read. Yep. Let me still looking fine though. Waft wasted, almost about to be KO'd by K7. Let's see. And that oh, back wow. air. And that big noggin is gonna take that life. And Gluttony again moves on. And wow, Z hype, I guess so. Yep, Z hype is definitely here. So good stuff to Gluttony being able to continue on in the winner's bracket. Again, he's seated number eleven. A lot of people were saying, like at first they thought he was seated really low. Then he got seated eleven. So some people are like, I don't know, that might be too high. No. No, he's been uh Tweak's, Tweak's an absolutely amazing player. But remember, I, I'm just saying, at one point he was like struggling a bit when he wasn't playing Wario. The one tournament he lost was before, or before he actually took Wario out in tournament.